Hi everybody, Ken Marshall here. It's been a while since I've made a video and so I thought I'd check in. There are a couple of things that I really want to talk to you about that I'm really excited about. And the first one is a uh, real-time uh, video that was uh, just recently done by Titanic Honor and Glory. I'm sure you're aware of Titanic Honor and Glory. If you haven't checked out uh, their Facebook page lately or their website, um, <clears throat> I would urge you to take a look at this amazing uh, real-time animation that they did. They worked really hard for about a month to pull together uh, Britannic's last hour of float uh, from the time that the uh, mine exploded until she, she dipped under the sea. And uh, uh, a lot of us had a little part in it. I was uh, tapped to read a little bit of narration for, for the thing. And it's, it's really spellbinding and utterly awesome to look at. Uh, um, you know, even the most uh, confident Britannic historian, you know, can learn something from watching this video because it puts you in the experience of actually being there uh, like, like never before. Uh, it's uh, really eye-opening. So I recommend that. Uh, the second thing is uh, titanicchannel.tv. And maybe you're uh, aware of this as well. I, I know it's been mentioned on uh, this, this Facebook page. But uh, I'm really excited about this. Uh, there's nothing like it. There's never been anything like it. Um, um, it's hard to even, I don't even know where to start. There's so many things I'd love to say about this thing. But, uh, you know, there is no time. But I guess the, the main thing about titanicchannel.tv, and you can just Google it. If, you, if, you, if you're not aware of it, Google titanicchannel.tv, and uh, you can see a little preview that they have there um, uh, of some of the, uh, the interviews and get a sense for, for what it's like. But the, the really cool thing about it is that it's not like your typical you know, TV documentary where uh, you're looking at these brief edited sound bites and it's all geared for the you know, sort of the 13-year-old the, uh, the demographic out there, and they're trying to keep the pace up and keep, keep going so that you don't click your, uh, your remote and change channels. They want to keep your interest going every, every, every single second. This is different. Uh, Titanic Channel, channel t dot TV is, uh, is, is really geared more towards, I mean, I don't, I don't want to turn the amateurs away, but it's, it's more geared toward the serious, thoughtful, really interested uh, person who's interested in the Olympic class and other liners. Um, it's deep. Uh, it's, it's, uh, there are long segments. The interviews can last anywhere from, you know, eight minutes to, to 12 or 15 minutes long. And it's just a person like myself sitting there um, looking at the camera and telling a story or, or reminiscing about something, that, an experience that we've happened that we've happened, I mean that we've experienced. Um, as you can see, I'm a little nervous. I hate being in front of the camera. <laughs> so, anyway, doing the best I can here. Um, it's, that, that to me is the best part about titanicchannel.tv, is, uh, is the slow pace of it, the fact that you get the full uh, experience. It allows historians, authorities, experts, a chance to really expound on a topic or an experience that they've had. Uh, they interviewed me back in uh, uh, October, and uh, there have already been segments on about uh, uh, me talking about meeting my very first Titanic survivor uh, friend, uh, Edwina McKenzie, reminiscing about uh, what she was like. And, and uh, let's see, I've uh, spoken about finding the uh, the shoes at the Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution, the shoes on the ocean floor uh, that, uh, that I saw while studying the Angus photographs there, thousands and thousands of images. Uh, and then there's going to be upcoming segments that I did about working on the Jim Cameron movie and, and, uh, and others. So uh, it's, it's just really interesting. I mean, you've got uh, uh, just so many knowledgeable, experienced people uh, contributing to this site, some of the really stellar names out there in the Titanic world. So, um, if you're kind of on the fence about it, I really urge you to go and check out their previews, titanicchannel.tv, see what you think. 
I think it's an incredible bargain, really. If you get the, the yearly subscription, uh, it's like uh, less than 30 cents a day to, uh, to, to have all of this knowledge right at your fingertips. I've learned so much already just in, in, uh, in watching it for about the last month or six weeks since it, since it premiered. Uh, every single day, there's there's eye-opening, fascinating information on this on this thing. So, I can't recommend it highly enough. And uh, the the last thing I wanted to talk about is uh, is the raffle that uh, I, I just launched again. And uh, I hope that you're uh, considering uh, participating. Uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, to doing a, a painting for the winner, a custom painting. That person gets to pick. Uh, any ship that he or she likes within reason. I limited it to eight of the great liners just because those would be the, the, uh, um, the easiest for me to access. I have a lot of information and data and reference material for the Queen Mary, the Queen Elizabeth, Lusitania, Mauritania, Olympic, Titanic, Britannic, uh, and, uh, and Normandy. So those are the ones I, I, I limited it to. Um, but we'll have the drawing this coming Monday on December the 6th. And, uh, or is it Tuesday? Tuesday, I'm sorry. And um, uh, for all those who are uh, uh, signing up and ordering prints or uh, G-clays or other products from Transatlantic Designs, I wish you uh, good luck. And uh, uh, I look forward to working with the winner uh, personally on uh, doing this custom painting for you, the lighting direction, the sea condition, the wind direction, and whichever ship that you choose. And that person may be you. So, good luck. That's it for now. I'll see you on the day of the raffle drawing. All right, take care.